Reach from tip to toe. This exercise could more accurately be called reach from tip to heel, but let's be honest, tip to toe just sounds better. While lying on your back with knees bent, bring awareness to the points of contact between the back of the head, mid-back, and pelvis on the floor. Engage a light chin tuck and the lower front ribs down as you engage your abdominals. From this position, reach your heels away from your hips. Imagine you are standing and pushing your feet into the floor. Then, reach your hands away from your heels and down towards the floor. When you do this, try to not shrug the shoulders towards the ears. Rather, think about creating length and reaching from your torso through the underarms to the tips of the fingers. Get tall, get long, and stay strong through the midsection so that you are not arching from the lower back. Maintain a deep and relaxed diaphragmatic breathing pattern throughout the exercise. To add a challenge to this exercise, have your friend throw the tubing at your face. No, I'm just joking. But you can do this exercise with added resistance to facilitate strength and length in this position. Shown here, a tubing is hooked around the feet and held with the hands as the heels and hands are reaching away from each other and towards the ground. If you have difficulty controlling the pelvis and lower back as you reach both legs away, you may reach one foot and then the other. This will give you a more stable base and less weight or intensity on the core muscles and therefore less stress on the lower back. Remember to maintain a deep and relaxed diaphragmatic breathing pattern throughout the exercise.